For the following exercises, sketch a line with the given features. So the line has to pass through the points negative 6, comma, negative 2, and 6, comma, negative 6. So basically, what we need to do is plot an axis. Plot a y-axis and an x-axis. Remember, the y is always vertical, x is always horizontal. You can label them if you want. If you don't, eh, who cares? So let's plot this point. So remember, the points always work y, uh, excuse me, <laughs> x, I wrote it right, said it wrong, x comma y, always. So the first coordinate here is always the x, and the second one is always the y. So first thing I'm going to do is find where negative 6 is. I'm going to start at the origin, and I'm going to find where negative 6 is then. Remember, moving to the right is positive, and moving to the left then on the x-axis, that is, is negative. So i got to move to the left six spots. So one, two, three, four, five six right there right so let's erase those points and let's plot it okay now where's the next point well the next point turns out to be now six come uh well what, what am i talking about andrew you didn't plot the <laughs> you didn't plot the y part oh my goodness so anyway here i am i'm going to put a little x now don't forget to do the y actually i did that on purpose right i'm just seeing if you're paying attention so now don't forget to plot the y. So we went out six units on the, on the x-axis. Now we have to go down two units on the y-axis. Why down? Be well, because it's negative. Down is negative, up is positive. So I got to go down two units, and it looks like right here. That's where I'm going to be plotting my point now. Okay, so this point has a coordinate of, yeah, I could write it in if we want, negative 6, comma, negative 2. Okay, how about now the next point? Again, x always comes first, y comes second. So i got to go out six units, start at the origin again, out six units, okay, on the x, so one, two, three, four, five, six, great, so we're going to, we're right around here, and then i got to go down six units now on the y, okay, so one, two, three, four, five, six, right, so we're going to be plotting it right about there. So let's just clean that all up, and let's plot the point. And now what we can do is we can write it in if we want it, we don't really have to, six comma negative six, and now all we have to do and what I'm going to do here, I'm just going to move this out of the way a little bit. And now all we got to do is literally connect the dots. All right. So we're just connecting those dots. Oh, man. Remember when you used to do that as a kid? Play connect the dots? God, we were so lucky as kids. And there you go. All right. There's the line. Now let's do the same thing for the second uh, question. Now let's fly through this. Passing through the points negative 3 comma negative 4 and 3 comma 0. So simply plot an axis. All right, I'm going to cheat here a little bit, copy this, and paste it on over here. Look at that. Voila. And then plot now these points. So negative 3 comma negative 4. i got to go out 3 units to the left on the x, and then down 4 units on the y. Okay, so right here. Similarly, 3 comma 0, start at the origin again. i got to go out 3 units to the right because it's positive, and then I don't have to go anywhere on the y. Did I say y twice? I don't know. I'm going out on the x because it's positive 3, all right, and then I don't have to go anywhere on the y. So hopefully I said that right this time. Now just literally draw a line that connects those points, all right? Connect those dots, and voila. Guys, thank you very much for tuning in. I appreciate it. Hopefully this video helps, and if it did, tell your friends, all right? We'd love to help them too. Thank you so very much.